What's up, everybody? This is my first video. If y'all like it, we'll make some more. Today, we're drinking some Shiner Strawberry Blonde. Pretty good. But we're here to talk about a new tool that I just picked up. This is the Ideal Circuit Breaker Finder. We're going to talk about why you might need it, situations you might need it, and what it does. Anyway, this is the transmitter. You plug this into a receptacle and this red light will come on indicating power. Now this isn't like a plug checker or a GFI tester. You don't have any diagram right here. You don't have any correct open ground, open neutral. Just one light indicates power is on that circuit. Now this is the receiver. And whenever you'll take this to the panel, turn it on, this red light will come on and it'll give you a nice audible beep whenever you get to the correct breaker. That allows you to turn it off without any trial and error first time. And you know, if you're working, if you do service work, you know, you might be in a office building, a bank, things like that, where you cannot just go through and flip off random breakers and you know, till you eventually hit the right one. Now, there's also the method of just short it out, trip it, We've all done it, but now there's a better way. My thinking was when I bought this, got this off Facebook, paid about $20 for it. I was uh, looking online. They retail for around 80 to 100. There's a cheaper version that Ideal makes. Klein makes a version, and there's a ton of, ton of them on Amazon, but Ideal's a good brand. Used a lot of their stuff before. Seems to work pretty well. My thinking was that if this will trace the hot all the way back to the panel, that it might be able to show you other devices on the same circuit. Now that's not the case. I plugged the transmitter <coughs> into a uh, plug and I went to some other devices, switches, things that I knew were on the same circuit. And anyway, it doesn't work like that. It's not a wire tracer. If you're looking for a wire tracer, this isn't it. This tool is strictly for showing you what breaker to controls the receptacle that this is plugged into. Now for service work, this is handy. This is a great tool. You know, you don't have to make a big spark and scare everybody working in this office. For new construction, things like that, I mean, this isn't really a piece of equipment you need to go out and purchase, keep on your truck. But like I said, for service work, no more tripping breakers, no more trial and error, no more walking around warning people, hey, you know, the power might right, go out. So let's give it a test. Got our receptacle here. I'm gonna plug our transmitter in. We've got a red light. Now we're gonna read the instructions on the receiver. Plug in transmitter, go to panel, turn on receiver, away from power, touch nose of receiver on first breaker, slide nose down each breaker on both sides of panel, note receiver beeps frequently while it measures signal strength. Slide nose down each breaker again until receiver beeps on correct right, breaker. Here at our panel, gonna turn it on away from power, we're gonna slide the nose of the receiver down. The instruction said may make a few beeps as it's sensing. Let's go and see. As you can see, power is out. So, did exactly what it was supposed to do. You can't ask for any more than that. So, this is a very specific tool for a very specific application. This isn't going to replace your plug testers. This isn't going to replace your non contact voltage tester. It's not what it is. It does one job and it seems to do it pretty well. You need to identify a breaker without going through trial and error or Tripping it out, making a short circuit. Pretty good way to go. So, I think it worked pretty well. I'm gonna keep this on the work truck, try it out in the real world. Probably gonna be pretty handy. Well, anyway, that's it on the uh, Ideal Circuit Breaker Finder. Hope y'all liked this video. And like I said, if you like it, let me know. Make some more. Have a good one.